This is Ken Hans, the best storyteller in Texas. Thanks for listening. We hope you enjoyed today's segment. In some states, the, the members of the legislature don't have any staff, and that's good government because you're dealing with one one person. Uh, I worry about getting more staff, more staff, and you have to deal with them. We dealt with a person. She worked for a state senator, and we were meeting with her on the issue, and she said, well, you know, senator's going to vote against that, and that's why I want to talk to him. And she said, why? I said, I like this. In-. She said, he's going to do what I say. And I thought, Wow. We used to call them junior senators. They, you know, they, they get carried away. Most of them in Texas do not. You know, it's pretty rare you get some of the staff. Staff tries to listen and, and get the information that they remember, that whatever you're saying. And uh, But the legislative process, you know, you go to a senator or congress. I had a lady come to me in Lubbock, and she had a, uh, had a question. She said, I didn't, she waited until the town hall meeting was over and she came up and approached me. And, and she said, I didn't want to ask it. It's kind of a stupid question, I guess. But she had been, uh, her husband had been in the military and they got a divorce. And she got a certain part of his retirement because she had been married to him during that period of time and she was entitled to it. And that to get it, she'd have to sue him in state court for breach of the divorce decree, and that take time and everything. And she said, "Why can't they just pass a bill that that if you've gotten a divorce, that the parties, you know, notify the Pentagon, and the Pentagon just sends two separate checks, makes it easier, and everybody gets their fair share." And I said, that, "That's a good good idea." So we introduced a bill, and I had. Uh, uh, couple of people helped me on it uh, that uh, one uh, uh, Pat Schroeder from uh, Colorado is a very liberal member and, and I had uh, uh, one that uh, well, Jesse Helms was for it very conservative member over in the Senate and we passed that bill and it was uh, it, it, whatever the divorce decree said you sent it to the Pentagon and they split up a check and that uh uh, President Reagan signed it into the law uh, about two years after this lady showed up at a town hall meeting. And so it with a, quote, stupid question. It wasn't stupid at all. It was a good suggestion. So people forget that there is a way to have input in the legislative process, and that's by going to town hall meetings and, and voicing your concern. And like I say, in, in some areas, you, your legislative process is really open to the public. And uh, the smaller the, the state government, the more open it's going to be. 